Hey guys, it's Emily. I'm here at Patoka Lake. It's time to go inside and start their annual Eagle Watch. So, let's go. Lessons here to teach us a little bit more about the eagles. So join in and take a look. These birds are just like us. They, we, you need a few things, right? You need a uh, clean food source, clean water source, and space to raise your family. That's what these guys need. Just like West, that's what we need. So if we go out on an eagle watch, much like we are about to do today, um, what can we look for? The eagle nest is put pretty unmistakable. You will know the eagle nest when you see it. And it'll be a big, long, kind of cone-shaped nest that's, that's, like I said, five to seven feet across. Wow. Almost as big as their wingspan, but enough for their right. family. So now that you and I have had a chance to learn about the bald eagles, I think it's time to join up with the caravan crew and hopefully find one for ourselves. So let's join them. Come on. I've met up with my friends and I in the caravan. I have my map and my trusty binoculars. We are ready to do some eagle watching. So we've arrived here at Patoka Lake. I think we've made our first stop on the caravan. We're actually going to see one of the eagles' nests and hopefully make that spotting. So let's go see what they have to say and see if we can spot our first eagle. Come on. If you follow the water line, there's like a buoy or a sickup coming out of the water, maybe. Uh huh. Okay. So midway between where the road ends and that buoy go up, up about up in the trees. You know. I see a nest. I really do. Well, my friends and I have just spotted our first eagle, so now it's time to get back in our caravan and go find the next nest. Come on, let's go. Eagles tend to be around what? Dead animals bodies of water, which is the main key, as well as their nests. So I think we have spotted a body of water. We just gotta get our wheels there first. Then we're gonna get out and start the search. Well, my Friday Zone field crew and I decided to stop and check out this nest. Now, much like this nest, eagle's nests are perched in a tree, very similar to this, or in a wedge of a tree. Fortunately, this one's a little too low for it to be an eagle's nest, so we'll hop back in the van and continue on with our caravan. Wow, so neat. Now, helpful tip, make sure you use a pair of binoculars or a scope. It really helps just because your naked eye cannot spot something so far away. But make sure you aim it at the tallest tree. It really will help. Well, we've had a wonderful day here at Patoka Lake, learning helpful hints to help us find some eagles and their nests. Now, keep your tips handy and your binoculars and get out there and try and find one yourself. Thanks for joining us on this Friday's own field trip.